So Q&A recently happened and Vincent Lemmings dropped bombshells after bombshells. So many news. This is part one of I don't know how many of us recapping whatever we learned. This video will be focusing specifically on level 9 aka mall level because this is the first level that we'll face in chapter 5. Let's talk about it. what is up YouTube. It's your boys making pie here. Apologies for scarce uploads. Let's start with the big one ladies and gentlemen. Level 9. Title has been revealed. Brace yourselves. Holiday Horror. Ooh, it has been confirmed, ladies and gentlemen. It has been confirmed. So level 9 and level 10 names have been confirmed. So the mannequin's level, again, to reiterate, is called Holiday Horror. And level 10 title will be called Prison Panic, which we'll talk about in tomorrow's video, since we're going through level by level. I said this on my Twitter. You can follow me. I was like, hey, yo, who goes to a mall to spend holidays? Bruh. I don't. <laughs> but I know. I know what you mean. I know exactly what Holiday Horror means. It's basically holidays. People are here to shop for their, you know... Whatever, yeah. It was also revealed that Puppet King, who is the boss, we've seen his photo, we've seen his face. It was revealed that although he is very powerful, but he's not more powerful than, let's say, Mama Bear. See, Mama Bear is one of the powerful characters in Dark Deception. So, Puppet King is powerful, but he's not more powerful than these characters. However, unlike Mama Bear, who has very limited abilities, Puppet King has a variety of options to attack. This is keeping in mind both Mama Bear's chasing abilities as well as boss fight. Combine all those abilities and options, Puppet King still has more options in terms of how he attacks. Then Vincent Living said that, yes, it is obvious, Puppet King is tall. Oh, wow. His height is probably comparable to Joy Joy Gang or Mama Bear. A lot of people think that Joy Joy Gang characters or Mama Bear, they're not as tall because when we're playing in their level, they don't look as big. But when you put all of them in comparison, these characters are tall. One question many would ask, is Puppet King himself a mannequin? Is he a puppet? Because, you know, he's the king of the puppets. He's controlling these mannequins and whatnot. It has been revealed that, yes, he himself is a puppet and king, both figuratively, because, you know, he's in Moloch's pocket. He's guarding those ring pieces and whatnot. But also, he himself, in a physical form, also a mannequin and puppet, which makes sense. Duh. Then a little bit tease for tomorrow's video. The Blob and Dark Star from the future levels are not part of level 9. Level 9 will not feature previous characters or even future characters, they're just mannequins, Malak, and, and, you know, a very contained level. It was also revealed that since we've seen multiple mannequins, like the red ones or the white ones, it has been revealed that they do behave differently, that's why they have the color shades. Now, I talked about this in details before, and there are, you know, fan games that I played that have those <laughs> color shading, but they don't do anything separately. But in Dark Deception here officially, they will be behaving differently and separately based on their types, in this case, red ones and white ones. And before anyone say anything, I, I can't even believe somebody asked this question. Yes, primal fear will work oh on God, mannequins, God. so you can stun them if, if you get cornered. Then, if you, do you all remember this Santa freaking doo-doo head model? I literally called it a prop. I literally said it is a prop from Chapter 5. But somebody asked Vincent Livings <laughs> that a yo, and I'm not joking, you can actually look it up on the Q&A. They asked if this is part of a trap or is it a trap? <laughs> Vince said, no, it's not. It is just that a statue, a model, a prop in the mall because, you know, it's the holiday season when we're playing in the mall and whatnot and it's a part of the story and whatnot. So, you know, speaking of that food court, you know, I remember in one of the first teasers ever that we saw related to chapter five, we saw the food court by ourselves. There was a tree there. There was some FNAF 6 mod, I, 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 Egg Baby, I can't remember his name. I had a theory and I said this, that we will have something to you know, experience, something like fun, something like interactable. Like, to give you an example, like Princess Quest mini games when you're exploring Pizzeria. Not exactly that, but just to give you like a small example, they're not comparable at all. But anyways, Food Court specifically will have something interactable and players can, you know, interact there and have fun while getting chased by mannequins. Some of you might be asking, hey, yo, smack, how many zones are going to be there? Well, it has been confirmed that all levels in Chapter 5 will have three zones. This entire week, I will be covering Dark Deception every single day until we have all the Q&A covered. 
And final thing, some of you might be asking, hey, yo, when are we gonna get teasers or, you know, gameplay screenshots and whatnot? It has been confirmed that soon after Dark Deception, Chapter 1 demo, Super Dark Deception demos, again, separate video for that, and the Monsters Mortals revival, then it will finally slowly move towards Chapter 5 teasers. So next month is April, with the big revival and the demos of Super Dark Deception, Chapter 1 and whatnot. After that, we will start getting Chapter 5 teasers slowly, slowly, they're still hoping for a quarter three release date. Again, more on that in future video. And ladies and gentlemen, that was everything you need to know about level nine from the Q&A recap that y'all got. Tomorrow we'll talk about Dark Star level, aka level 10. The day after that, level 11, level 12. And the day after that, you know, Super Dark Savior and Monsters Mortals. Even the sequels and all that good stuff and merchandise. So stay tuned so for more. <laughs> yeah.